everyone, my name is Veronica and uh, I'm a Mandarin teacher in Australia. I have five years working experience in the primary school and also uh, home tutoring for teaching the children how to speak Mandarin. And we have this channel because I want more people know how to speak Mandarin and I also want to introduce the different cultures between the Chinese culture and you know compare with the different culture what's the difference in between and also um, I find a lot of people they can speak Mandarin but they can't pronounce that really really properly and we know actually uh, Mandarin have the different pinging and different tones and different tones will give people the different meaning and it probably will make people confused about you know what to talk about if your tongue is wrong and so that's why we have this channel and this is my partner Sam and Sam would you like to introduce yourself? Hi I'm Sam I'm uh an Aussie, been you know, born here, lived here my whole life, and uh, it's my first time learning Mandarin. Yes, yeah, so I think Sam will give us a lot of very good example about not a proper pronunciation, and it should be perfect for me to correct that and give you a very good example about that. All right, so for the first video, we want to teach people how to introduce yourself because no matter you know what people you met, you, the first conversation we might be have is, you know, people will ask you, what's your name? And uh, where you're from? Where you're from, yes. And uh, maybe your age and also probably about your interests as well, but it really depends on the occasion. So today we probably will have a really simple conversation about how to introduce yourself. Okay, so let's start for the first sentence you normally will ask a person when you just meet them at the first time. So what are you normally going to say? Oh, hi, how are you? Yeah, how How's are you? Day? How's your day? Good day. And probably what's up to warm up the topic right <laughs> yeah so in mandarin we will say 你今天过得怎么样? so the first one is 你 can you read? 你, 你 is you and 今天, 今天. 今天, yeah, 今天 is today yeah 过得, 过得. yeah 过得 is experience and 怎么样? 怎么样? 怎么样 is how so how's your experience of today? That is, 你今天过得怎么样? How's your day? Yeah, would you like to have a try again, please? 你今天过得怎么样? Yeah, excellent. So only the 今 is a little bit not proper. So 今, the J, we pronounce as 今, 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 今. Yeah, excellent. So 今天, 今天. Correct. So, 今天 is today. So, when we know how to ask the people, how were you? People normally will say, oh, not too bad. I'm very good. Or excellent. Or maybe just... Good things. Yeah, good thanks, right? So, I'm not too bad. We will say, 还不错. 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 Yeah. So, 还 actually means still. And 不 is not. 错 is wrong, so still not too wrong or still not too bad, which means not bad or I'm good. Yeah. All right, 还不错. Can you have a try, please? 还不错. Yeah, 非常好. And then we will. So what? What the next one we will say? Probably what's your name? Yeah, ask right. the other person what their name is. Yeah, correct. So, uh, we will say, 你叫什么名字? So, 你, 你, 你 is you, still same as the first sentence. 叫 is called. Called. Cool. Yeah, 叫, 叫. yeah, 非常好. 什么, 什么, 什么 is what. Yeah, and 名字, 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 yeah, 名字 is a name. So, you called, what name, what's your name? 你叫什么名字? Can you have a try, please? 你叫什么名字? Yeah, so I find a lot of people can't pronounce 子 very proper. So in English, they will say z, z, right? But in Mandarin, all of the z and i will call, uh, we will pronounce it as 子, 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 
Yes, 非常好 And this one, 什么？什么？什么？也是 So 什么 is what? So 什么名字 What's the name? All right. So would you like to have a try again, please? 你叫什么名字？什么名字？什么名名字？也非常好。你叫什么名字？你叫什么名字？非常好 ，excellent. So when you know how to ask the people what's your name, 你叫什么名字 ？Then you need to answer the person your name. So 你叫什么名字 ？What's your name, right? And when you answer the people's question, you will swap the person. The person as me. So me is 我。我。我。Yeah. So my name is Sam. 我叫 Sam. 我叫 Sam. Yeah. So actually, it means my or me called Sam. My name is Sam. 我叫 Sam. 我叫 Sam. 非常好 Right. So once we know the people's name, we probably want to know their age as well, right? So when you want to ask the people's age, you can ask them, 你多大了？你多大了 ？Yeah, so 你 is the same. You. You. 多 is how much, all right, or a lot. They actually can be a question words or just can be the words to describing the things a lot. It has a lot of things there. 大。大。Yeah, 大 is big. And 了，了 actually just uh, um, these words have no meaning. So just for complete the sentence, all right. So 你多大了？你多大了 ？Actually means you. How much big? Is <laughs> it actually for asking your age? So how old are you? Or how big are you? Yeah, for asking the age. So 你多大了 ？So how old are you? Can I ask? Thirty. Thirty. Okay, we same age. So you can say 我三十岁。我三十岁。Do you still remember what's the meaning of 我？ Me. Yes, excellent. And 三十 which means thirty, thirty, 三十 and the 岁 is years old. All right. So 我三十岁。我三十岁。非常好。So can I have a try? Ask you, and you answer me. So Sam, 你多大了？我三十岁。Excellent. So when we know the people's age and the name, we probably want to know their nationality as well. So where are they from, right? Yes.、Yeah, so in Mandarin, when we ask the people where are you from, we will say, 你来自哪个国家 So 你你 Do you remember what's the meaning of that? You. Yeah. Excellent. 来自来自 Yeah. 来自 is come from. 哪个哪个哪个 is which one? And the 国家国家国家 is a country. So the whole Sentence means you come from which country? So, 你你来自来自哪个哪个国家国家 Excellent. Would you like to have a try? <laughs> Challenge. 你来自哪个国家非常好 Excellent. And only one thing, same as 名字 So Z I we pronounce 子来自子也非常好来自哪个哪个也来自哪个来自哪个国家国家也非常好 So same as you know all the questions. When the people ask you the question, they will have the question words. In this sentence, 哪个 is a question word, which means which one, right? So when you answer people's question, you just need to delete 哪个国家 and use your own nationality to replace it. Same as the last question we ask, like、um, 你叫什么名字 So 什么名字 is what's your what's the name? It's a question. You use Sam to replace it. 我叫 Sam. So same as here, I come from Australia. 我我 yeah come from 来自 excellent Australia is very easy because 
we actually just uh, use the pronunciation as a Chinese style. Yes, so Australia, we say. Australia. Yeah, excellent. Australia. Australia. Yeah, so if I say, I come from Australia, how to say that? Bo. Yes, perfect. Well, I I come from Australia. And I actually come from China. China is a little bit different. We will say, You can say, 你来自中国. 你来自中国. Excellent. So you come from China, right? Yeah. So that's the whole conversation we will have today. And uh, do you want to have a practice on that? Yeah, sure. <laughs> I'm trying to ask you the question and uh, we just use the things we learned before and uh, to have a short review, all right? Yeah, so the first question is, how's your day? I will say, 你今天过得怎么样? 还不错? Yeah, 你叫什么名字? 我叫Sam. 非常好。你多大了？我三十岁。我三十岁。我三十岁。Yeah,非常好。And I would say, 你来自哪个国家？我来自。我来自澳大利亚。Yes, perfect. 你今天过得怎么样？ How's your day today? 你今天过得怎么样? How's your day today? 还不错, not bad. 还不错, not bad. 你叫什么名字? What is your name? 你叫什么名字? What is your name? 我叫 Sam. My name is Sam. 我叫 Sam. My name is Sam. 你来自哪个国家? Which country do you from? 你来自哪个国家? Which country do you from? 我来自澳大利亚 I'm from Australia 我来自澳大利亚 I'm from Australia Thanks everyone for tuning in and watching my first lesson in Mandarin Come back next time to listen to me butcher the rest of the language <laughs> Thanks for watching 谢谢大家 and see you on next video 再见 Bye. Bye.